So, uh, what's your name? I'm Talia. That's it. Bam. That's all the intro anyone needs. Here, today, so this is a video about 2022. And no, it's not Fix My Life. Mine's it's... Fix My Life. Um, good for him that his isn't Fix My Life. There you go. Okay. What is something you want to change in 2022? Okay. I don't know if many other people share the same experience, but um, this has been my goal for a couple years, but, you know, then COVID came and worsened it. Um, renew a thirst for life. So over the past couple of years, it's very easy to have lost a sense of purpose, especially as a result of mental boundaries, physical boundaries, um, in that respect, that was COVID lockdowns, losing a lot of friendships, things like that. It became very easy to lose a sense of who you're supposed to be. So this year, I'm, I myself, and I know many others agree, starting to want to actually live our lives again and start actually thinking about who we are as people, what we're supposed to do. and inherently experience each moment as it comes as opposed to planning ahead or relying on excessive rigidity. Done. Damn. That was like really well thought out. That was <laughs> it so wasn't, cool. it was improv. <laughs> I tried, I tried to articulate as best as I could. Super smart. I think this year, I just like, it kind of feels weird because what when I finish uni I'll be 19. Correct. That is a weird feeling. I will be one year into uni. Just for comparison. What your uh, isn't your uni is like seven years? So yes. Um, for context, I'm doing a double law degree and then doing a jurist doing a jurist doctor. Um, it's yeah. so long, I'm sorry. <laughs> but, at the end of it... Money! Continue. Okay. So... So, like, I also want to, like... I know, like, I haven't... So, like, I haven't been creating much content. I think, like, the last, like, public video that I posted was... Like, Men Can Cry or whatever. Um... And that was, what, back in lockdown? Which was a while ago. Um, I'm hoping I can post the... Imagine if I can post the, um, the horror film. That would be fun. You should do that. If you I, haven't, I haven't even seen it. Like, our editor hasn't sent it to us. It's a little bit concerning. It is a bit concerning. But, uh, yeah. I also just want to, yeah, I think finding friends, like a proper friend group would be good. Well, not even like a friend group, but like a certain number of friends would be nice to have. And not just people I hang out with maybe once or like once a month, but people like I'll hang out with like every week. Because at the moment I'm not hanging out with anyone but you. <laughs> um, and yeah, that's, that's about it. Here's a little bit of some words of wisdom. Um, even if it feels like you have very few friends, preferably for yourselves, for the in order to be beneficial in the long run. Don't hang on to toxic. Don't cling on to toxicity. Get rid of people who don't benefit you. Get rid of people who don't play into what you want to do, who don't appreciate you or your work or anything that you do. Um, even if it means that you end up with only one person after that, that one person will exponentially be better than several toxic people. Words of wisdom of the day that were incoherently spoken, but you know what, it's all right. Put those fragmented pieces together, little brain teaser for you. Moving on. You're gonna, like, you're gonna meet pretty. I'm sure you'll meet pretty cool teachers and pretty cool people too. So. 
I think throughout like last year I think I found like I found pretty good people unfortunately some of them left but I think a couple of them also stayed but uh yeah uni is good it's definitely way better than high school um 